What's good, y'all boys? I got a fire build for y'all today. This is going to be the best Wimby build. You're going to be able to shoot like Wimby, handle the ball, and block shots at a high rate. So we're going to get right into it. You see you can max out at a 92 defensive rebound, but if you want to add more weight, you definitely can. We get in gold box out beast, gold pogo, and gold rebound chaser. You literally going to have all the badges you need to play just like Wimby. Not going to hold you. So on top of that, we get in a 93 block. That's giving us gold paint patroller. And on top of that, so you actually can cap break this. So that's why we went with 83 interior. So to get Hall of Fame paint patroller, you got to add one point onto the interior and then four points onto your block. You feel me? So you definitely got to make sure you start off with 83 right here. And actually, like if you care about the shades of, you feel me? If you go 82 interior, that's going to give you shades of Wimby. But we went 83 to make sure you feel me. We hit them caps. So we get in and move going forcer on this build too. Silver high flying denier. Ball handle at 70. If you went minimum wingspan, you could get a 73 ball handle. That'll give you six like KD six and anything. But for real, for real, you you good with the 70. And you don't want to go minimum wingspan anyway, cause to really get the Wimby effect, bro. Like, you need some of that wingspan. I'm not going to hold you. But got to make sure the shooting right. So you get in gold set shot specialist, silver dead eye, and you actually do get bronze limitless range. And that's in the tier two. So, <laughs> yo, if you actually wanted the uh, max plus one perk that, you could throw that on silver. But I really wouldn't do that. I ain't going to hold you. I probably would max plus one the set shot specialist. That'd be he, yeah, for a fact. But I can imagine you not gonna only be catching shooting on this build. But this some heat right there. All of that, and we just now getting to the finish, <laughs> bro. Like the finish, it is fire. So again, gold rise up, elite standing contact dunks. You get in all the dunk packages you need, and you really you could go seventy five if you wanted to on the driving dunk. You ain't gonna lose no badges or nothing. But you're going to lose a lot of dunk packages. Not going to hold you. To play like Wimby, you definitely going to need this at 80. You get a lot of, like, you actually get a Tomahawk package at 80. You get a lot of reverse packages, a lot of dunks off one. So you definitely going to have 80 driving dunk. You're driving layup up at 80. They get that silver physical finisher. And you get Jokic package. You get a Sabonis layup package. You feel me? This is pressure bro. not gonna hold you 84 close shot that give you silver paint prodigy you could go for gold flow game if you want to go 86 on a close shot but i i probably wouldn't even do it i ain't gonna hold you but this is really all around pressure and again with them five cap breakers like you you don't even gotta use cap breakers on this build bro for over like it's heat already but when you do get them five you want to make sure you throw it on the interior and the block to get that Hall of Fame. And that's some heat right there. Not going to hold you. But, oh, yeah, my bad. I forgot to show you how to take it. Yo, this build get fire takeovers, too, bro. Yo, this build is crazy. So you actually get Shades of Chet and Chris Stops. That third one would have been Shades of Wimby, too. But we changed that uh, the interior rating. But that's fire right there. To know you get in. Shades of the unicorn, you feel me? And Chet, too. So, this heat, uh, my bad. We gonna go to the takeovers. So, you get in block party. This bucket takeover is fire, bro. You get a plus seven to the close shot, the driving layup in the mid range, board beast, block party, clinic. Yeah, that's heat too. Clinic is definitely fire. Plus seven to the layup, mid range, and a three ball. Eraser, elevate, feathery touch, glass gunner. Glass gunner is for sure a top three takeover on this build. And yeah, you definitely could use the boost to the rebound it too. I ain't gonna hold you. Glass warrior. You get a horse on this build. Midi Maestro, Offensive Artist, that's <laughs> heat, bro. Pay Dominance. 
You get powerhouse too. Physicality, splash tower, SWAT specimen, spot up the commander, and that's it. Yo, that's really a lot of takeovers, bro, on a 7 1. But for sure, the number one takeover I would go with, with on this build is probably Bucket. Bucket or Clinic. Yeah, I probably would go with Clinic. Yeah, I'm not even going to hold you. Yo, this is pressure, bro. Either Clinic or Glass Gunner. But, again, you got a lot of options to choose from, bro. Like, it's not just, like, a couple takeovers. Or it's not like you got to pick a takeover that only boosts two attributes or something like that, bro. Like, you got a lot to work with. You got takeovers that boost your three ball, your midi, and your layup all at this in one takeover, bro. <laughs> all the seven one, that's crazy. You feel me? But I'm gonna hit y'all in the next one. I got more heat coming for y'all. Just hit that like button.